This is sort of Kalis. And you know, it's 48 inches long. It was supposed to have been uh, made from the hair of Kalis as he dipped it in the volcano. And I just kind of swirled it around it. But it also was designed that it would be defensive and aggressive and keep your opponent's blades away from you and trapped in a curved spot. And it also allows for kind of a nunchaku style fluidity of motion so you can do nice glissades with it and have a constantly changing motion of how the weapon can be used. I wanted it to have some fluidity and uh, easy motion for both uh, offense and defense. These are some of the deadliest weapons in the galaxy. Batlets that you're used to seeing are all pointed forward. What that does is essentially gives you an offensive weapon immediately. We wanted to re-explore our Klingons as more of a defensive, trying to protect your honor and your world. We simply turn them backwards, giving the idea that, OK, if necessary, I can turn this, I can spin it, I can stab you with it, but presenting I'm on a defensive look. I hit my thruster pack to get away. I somehow knocked him into his blade. I killed him. <laughs> Impossible. So I, I wanted it to be flexible and like with any heavy weapon in Asian martial arts styles, you let the weight of the weapon guide it, and you kind of guide its momentum rather than doing the chopper style. We simply turn them backwards.